So, we're here with Elise Galan, who is from Quebec, Canada. Elise, you were actually part of Educate Madrid last year, yes. and now you're back again for another year with us, uh, and you, you're able to experience the change in venues. Yes. We've, we've made a, a dramatic move, and I was just curious, uh, what, it, what is your impression of the new Educate Madrid? Well, I think it's awesome because I can share my rooms with the teammates, with girls, and I like the place. It's really beautiful when you walk outside. You have a park right there. You can go run and do your own stuff. And the metro station is really close. You just walk maybe five minutes and you go to a Spanish class. And then in the morning we have training. We just walk with all the guys and the girls. So we create and a good, uh, how do you agree? It's a good atmosphere with yeah. the group together. Yeah. Now, Elise, yeah. talk to me specifically then about the food because last year oh. we were at, at the University Cafe, which yeah. is okay but not great. Yeah. And this year we're at a Spanish res restaurant, La Becada. What do you think about the Spanish affiliated restaurant for Educate Madrid? It's awesome. I love it. It's like really Spanish food. Last year was like kind of. Not really good, but this year I love the food. It's really good. Yeah, last year was a university cafeteria, probably not the best, but uh, this year we're very, very pleased to be affiliated with the La Becada Spanish Restaurant. In terms of your football, uh, what is it that you hope to accomplish this year at Educate Madrid? Uh, I would like to go in the B team with the female team to... Of Madrid CFF, the yeah. team that you'll be trialing with, right? Yeah. So your, your goal is to make that B team, and from there, obviously, try and win a, a starting spot. Yeah. Okay, that's Elise Galan in her second year at Educate Madrid from Quebec, Canada. Thanks for your time, Elise. No, no problem.